Hey everyone, welcome back to the Joshua Plan. Crazy here and all, no hat today. I just decided to throw it all up. No hat, do my thing. Went for a run earlier, trying to start working out again. My legs are a little jelly today. And my swing's been kind of off. Um, tell you about the tournament I played yesterday, which was Saturday. Not a great tournament. I ended up like just, I could not putt and I could not chip for the life of me. I ended up like nearly driving the green on this par, drivable par four. I was probably 10 steps off, if that. And ended up chipping up. It checked up too much. And then I three putted from six feet. It was, it was horrible. So I got a different putter in the bag now because I got to get, I'm going back to something I'm feeling a little bit more confident with. So anyways, enough about that. Uh, we are on round two of the Barbasol Championship at Dark Horse Golf Club. I got a plus four on the first round. Not the greatest, not the worst, but you know, doable. Um, we're hoping to go for an even round par today to get myself into some sort of maybe top 15 in the uh, net scores. So without further ado, let's, let's get it done. gentlemen I hope you're ready for some golf because it's almost guaranteed to be a good time here on the TGC network we are on the first hole tee and we have final round coverage just about to kick off let's go uh, just a little housekeeping I did change out the tee holders and they're white so sometimes they've been acting really finicky with stuff especially like a three wood and uh, um, my hybrid I use when I put a tee there and tee them up that way so um, hopefully that doesn't happen very often here. I'm gonna to try to m minimize it as much as I can, but if it does, that's the reason why it thinks the ball's like basically still there or something. So anyways, let's see what we can do here. The driver, this might not be the best play of driver on this one, but that's all right. I wanna hit driver, so. To be heading Decent to strike. A lot of spin though, which will probably be good for that, that drive. Stop right there. Oh, it had to go just barely yeah, into it, didn't it? Did Man. See that going into the rough. Good drive though. I'll take that. See how this next shot just a little, out of the little spin issues there, but that's okay. Um, also, I need to fix this screen eventually it came seems popped on it once again so i just need to take it down and uh get it situated once again so hopefully this week i'll be doing that so bear with me while i get that taken care of a little deep give me a little spinach And I think he that one, I, I don't that. feel like I swung very hard, but man, that thing went carried 80, 85 yards. So it's pretty damn here. good for my lob wedge. I'll take it. Right, this looks fairly straight, a little bit right to left, but not much. 27 footer. Go baby, go. Get up there close. Ooh, and just inches away from greatness. All right. Can't par them all if you don't par the first one, right? What do we got next here? And starting today's round off at even par. And now setting up for the par four. <clears throat> yeah, as I said, I'm going to try to start working out more. I've got the uh, relay marathon that I do each year coming up here in October. So I really want to make sure I start running sooner rather than later that for that cause <laughs> every year. It's like, Oh, I got a month. I got to start training, which is just stupid. That was a low bullet. Had no spin to it though, but no 
no height either. That'll work. And nothing wrong with that shot. <laughs> driver 60, driver 60. Where is this at on there? Uh, a little at the back, but I can probably spin that back. 27 feet uphill. We'll see if this is it's full shot. I'm thinking like 75 in my head, if that makes anything. Get up there at least. Okay, that works out good. Let's spin back. Yeah, buddy. A little spinach on that one. Carried it at 75, so that was perfect. It came out low and like piercing trajectory. I like that. We'll this spin is for on that sucker to get him closer. All right, this would be a nice left to right, 11 footer. It's probably a little too much out to the side, but that's all right. Turn in. Oh, oh geez, oh, slow down close, ball. Okay. All right, par's okay. Like I said, you can't par them off. You don't par the first two now. And that holds. What do we got next? Par three, par four, par five. I think it's a three. And yeah. now the third hole to you. <sighs> two fourteen. Thirteen feet downhill. Ugh. I was playing this morning. <laughs> such a difference between the front bet nine and the back nine. It was like really unfreaking believable the differences. Front nine, I ended up uh, shooting seven over, I think it was. And then the back nine, I went parred all the holes through hole 15, and then I birdied 15, and I ended up double bogeying 16, bogeying 17, and then parring 18 for a two over. That's a five hour. <clears throat> Why couldn't I have hit like this yesterday? Like seriously, this is just ridiculous, the difference between yesterday and today. It would be nice to, you know, play well in that tournament yesterday I played in. Oh, come on. How did that roll all the way down there? Dang. Pretty sure he's gonna like that one. Hope that's still in the green. And this one's for birdie. It is cool. This is a long freaking putt though. Jeez, how'd that roll that far to the right? So they're gonna go out even further than that. All right, well this is just a hit and hope type of shot, you know what I mean? 107. Has enough to it. It's gonna get in the circle. Damn, that was actually pretty freaking good. <laughs> wow. That was a okay in my book. All right, I hope we have a part five next. And as we look at the board, our leader is currently sitting at nine under. And now the fourth hole. Yeah, part five, beautiful. Oh, one of these days I need to get myself a new projector because this one is not light enough. It's like so dark. I want something that's like really nice, high knit, whatever it's called. <clears throat> Hit that one well. Yeah, I'll catch like a piece on the left, the hopefully. Stuff. Uh, a little high on the spin, 2900, but I'll take it. And about 245 yards to the pin. 245. Got good height to it there. I'm gonna aim over here. I'm gonna hit a high two hybrid, a three hybrid, I should say. 
hope that it gets up on the front edge. I don't really want to hit three wood on this one. I hit one of the best driver three wood combos this year today on hole number 15 in the home course. It was just gorgeous. <clears throat> it's gonna be more left than I want, but this isn't looking too good. It's safe. Yeah, I felt like it really came on the inside. I'm trying to like turn more down through the ball versus like coming from the inside, if that makes sense to y'all out there. 42. too much spin oh i thought that was gonna be way too much it was actually okay and pretty sure he's gonna pulled like it that. a little bit as well this one's about 11 feet from the cup 11 feet fairly straight too go right there because it doesn't turn a lot until the right at the end there Turn in, turn in now. Oh, how do you stop on the edge right there? You dirty dog. <clears throat> dirty, dirty a dog. That's gonna bring him down to even par. Like that says down to even par. Like Next it was like a change four, folks. <laughs> from what I was hitting, you know? All right, big old fairway out there. Let's just hit a nice drive down the center, shall we? Come on back a little bit. That one had some spin to it. I could tell just because it started climbing there. Also had a little bit of speed. Dang. Went further than I thought it was going to. About one f nine iron in, I'm guessing. About 143. From 140 yards out. 140. Hmm. All, the kind of, all depend on where it's at on the green. Oh, yeah. We're using a pitching wedge, not a nine iron on this sucker. Maybe I'll go a little bit hard at this one, too. Eight feet down, not a lot down, but help a little bit at least. Ah, oh, that one was toey. Dang it. Catch a piece on the right. That's eh, not going to. Shoot. All right, should be an easy chip up and down. Thinking. That was not a good swing. It was very toey. 13 yards. All right. Oh, come on. Oh, I should have hit the flag on that one. Dang. All right, gotta make this putt. This is must make putt in my mind. And this is to save par. All right, 18 footer. Get in. Oh, I turned at the last second there. Here. Oh man. Okay, now I need a bird. I was hoping I get all pars, just across the board, all pars that have been sweet. Shoot. And after that hole, one over. Oh. Just pulled that one just a little bit. I mean, pushed it. We find ourselves on the sixth full tee off. What do we got here? One, two, three. Oh, this one of the in between clubs here. And hopefully, it's at the back. Uh, I'm thinking a gap wedge should be good enough here. <clears throat> as long as I get it pretty good.
Oh, what am I doing on those shots? Just poor, poor execution. Oh, just, just, just a bleeder off to the right. And that's not been the trend today. He has been pretty good in uh, the area of greens and regulation today. Oh, that was a really poor execution once again. Dang it. <clears throat> All right, need this, this pot again. 20 feet away. Gosh. 22 foot. This thing is moving too. Go, 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 go. Oh, I'm just burning the friggin' edge on all these. So this is where uh, everything imitates what's outdoors in this game. Like I'm like doing the exact same thing on the actual courses. I'm just burning cups. I'm hitting good putts. I'm just not making putts. If that makes sense. All right, we got par five here. We're gonna look at this, make sure it's not in some stupid spot. All right. And there's a long bomb. Oh, folks. thank God oh I gosh. smoked that one, you guys. <clears throat> yeah, I hit that one real good. 164 ball speed on that sucker. That was a good freaking ball. All right, hopefully I have about 175 in. And about 175 yards <laughs> to the pin. <laughs> I love that. That is so freaking great. <laughs> No, we're not gonna have a five iron. Thank you very much. We are going to move it off to the right a little bit, just in case. Come on, Josh. Need this one. <clears throat> uh, I got worried. I got nervous about the water. How's the distance though? Smoke that one. Club. Pushed yeah, it. Not the greatest Pushed it because I got worried about the water. Shot. Bit too much club on that. <clears throat> Twenty yards. Uh, it's all downhill a little bit from there. So, all right, let's get it in there and get one back here. Freaking screw me. That was a, a shank that worked. Let's just put it that way. <laughs> God. And this for the birdie. It's pretty damn straight. Get in, get in, get in! Yes! Oh, nice putt there. Even with the shank, still make it in the bank. Yeah, boy. And plus one on the day after that hole. And now teeing off on this par four. Uh, not too much of a bleeder. Come on, be short of that water on the right. 
could be uh, could be bad. Oh god, I got lucky. That's okay. Wasn't a great swing. It was like weird. Uh, now this shot coming out of the rough. 107 is that? Up 15 feet. Out of the rough though, it's light rough. I'm gonna choke down a little bit on this 50. I hope that it gets there good. It was perfect. Oh, I'll stop right there. It's just amazing it's golf. Like one minute you have it and then the next minute you don't. It's the dumbest freaking thing ever. I swear, I don't know if everyone else has that same issue, here. but it's like, this morning, <laughs> first nine hole, didn't have crap. And then all of a sudden, all of a sudden I'm like, oh, I know how to golf again. And it's just the weirdest damn thing, I swear. I don't know how that ball can stay on right there. That is the craziest thing. <laughs> Ever to. Get in the hole. Oh, oh my so goodness, close. That was close. <clears throat> the funny thing about this putter is like, I probably hit it the best, but I don't want to hit it. I don't want to play and this putter. I like, a, I like a blade style putter, not a mallet, but okay, it's, <laughs> it's so stupid. But it's all about how you play with it, not how it looks, right? I mean, looks is part of it, but you gotta, gotta be able to hit it well. And the other part, putter, is just ice cold. Brittany is putting time out for the time being, I'll tell you that. That was a weird shot. That's gonna go places just because it has no spin, but man, it was not a good swing. Probably not happy with that. We got 80, 100 yards. Look at that. 100 yards, 24 feet uphill out of the heavy rough. It's heavy rough. You just never know what it's going to do. All right, this is what I'm going to do. We're just, just, just going to swing hard. Probably not a good idea but that's what we're gonna do. Try to get it to like a 105 carry, something like that. <clears throat> Pierce off to the right a little bit, but it's gonna, it's gonna stay right there. It's gonna be on the green, I should say. It's gonna roll back, because that thing is gonna have a little bit of a slope to it, but it's gonna, it should stay on the green. Oh, you freaking bastard, what? Jinx myself, y'all. I can't believe that didn't stay on the green. 24. That was a really poor effort. Please stay up top. Yeah, that was a poor effort. And this putt to save par. It's kind of a weird, weird little shot here. 31. Get in the cup. Get in. Oh, it turned at the last second. That was going straight towards it. Dang it. Man, that would have been nice to make. Oh. So now I'm two over again. And after that one, two over for the day. <sighs> okay, and the 10th hole. This one's gonna be fun. 61 feet downhill. This, this could go, go places. <clears throat> I 
That's gonna go places. The good's a good bounce left. That'll be great. Oh yeah. Straight left. Jesus. <laughs> All right, this should have about okay, 70 yards, I'm thinking. I have been spot on today with those, those uh, um, guesses. 70 yards. Be good. Spin, baby, spin! Oh, I just stopped it right there. It didn't pull it back. Like Dang it. That was a great, great 60 this degree. About 10 feet from the cup. Oh, that would have been nice if it would have stopped in the inside, but that's all right. I knew I pulled that a little bit. Ooh, that one's, uh, that's too bad. Didn't feel comfortable over that, or with that one as far as the reed goes. I should have pushed it off to the right a little bit more, but nah, whatever. And our leader is currently at 1400. I feel like this T is like way low down. Okay, now. Compared to normal, but it's working. So I can't really bitch about it too much, can I? <sighs> that's a weird. Freaking location. Didn't I go for it right here before? <laughs> the way I've been hitting my driver today, I'm going to go for it once again. This is really stupid, but I'm gonna do it anyways, just cause I wanna get over that damn creek. <clears throat> That's gonna do it too. Freaking right. Go, go, go! Ah, oh, he almost made it there. Dang. And he won't be too pleased. That would have been that. dope as hell. <laughs> and he is deep in the rough here for 218, this next one. 45 feet uphill out of the rough. This has hybrid written all over it. Oh, that was all toe. That's gonna work though. Come on, get up there. Ah, I thought it might roll up there. That would have been freaking sweet. Oh, look at that. Best make sure I get it up there, I guess, huh? God, again. Seriously, Josh? I didn't shake it once today out on the course. Actually, I did one time, one time. But thank God this is a par five because that would have sucked. Oh, come on. Okay, yeah, only rolled down a little bit. <laughs> Look at those angles. Club face, 25 degrees open. <laughs> That's freaking hilarious. For birdie. Yeah, we're gonna move this one quite a bit out here. Yep, 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 yep. 70 feet. What's it do at the end there? I know it moves back to the right. All right, let's try right there, because this is going to move hard at the beginning here. 70 feet. Oh, crap. Slow down. Damn it. <clears throat> wow, that was, that was not a good lag putt. <clears throat> and right, now I just have to make this putt from off the green, right? Look at this, it's pretty damn straight. 16 footer, downhill. 
straight. Turn back, turn back a little bit, turn back a little bit. Oh, that Dang was it. close. Push that one just enough to get it offline. Dang it. I need a birdie. This sucks. I need a freaking birdie. And currently sitting at three over for the day after that hole. I don't want to be three over. I want to be even par, and damn it. Up for the par four tee off. Let's just hammer the living piss out of this and get it close. I would love to be able to carry it 320, 330. God, that'd be awesome. <clears throat> That's gonna go miles. This one's looking like it's finding the fairway. That thing was smoked. Oh, 52 is close. <clears throat> Get up there on the green at least. I thought that was gonna be a lot better than it went, ended up turning out to be. I clipped that real nice. And this putt's for birdie. That was so close to being a shank though. This, that's my problem is I get it so freaking close to the, the dang, um, uh, what's it called, uh, hosel. My shots, it just, yeah. That's gonna be way too hard, I think. Needs to slow down. Ooh, oh. That was very close. I have no in between. I have a hundred and I have set uh, fifty. No seventy. And for the par, almost made it though. Turn in. Gosh! Solid putt. Gosh! Thank you. Thank you, my putter. Get me out of these tight situations. And after that one, he has. Is it gonna be a par three next, or what's gonna be next? And now par three. the 13th hole. 144, 52 feet downhill though. Whew. Not gonna be an eight iron. A little piercing right again. Gosh, catch a piece here, ladies and gentlemen. And it's definitely enough. That will not be on the green. That was. Just I'm glad I didn't hit any harder because that thing would have flew even further. It wasn't a great shot there. All right, ten yards. Stop, stop, stop! Oh my God, seriously. <sighs> I got a lot of practice to do between now and next weekend. It's our club championship, so I need to really it's practice these chip shots. Footer. I wish my, cl my club was closer so I could like go over there when I wanna practice a little bit, but it's not, so. But when I make the putts like that, this hole, I don't freaking so matter. And that hole is going to allow him to move up. And I hope there's a par five next. I really want a par five setting up oh, or a drivable par, par, four par four. I mean, yeah. All right, screw it. We're gonna go driver. Here. Oh, 
Oh, that's got to be good. Kick right now. Oh, you talk about an unlucky goddamn bounce. <laughs> God. Didn't get that member's bounce on that one. That's for shizzle. And let's see how this lie gets dealt with. Wow, that was not a member's bounce whatsoever. All right, just a little 18 yard shot here, not bad. Now spin right there, now stop, 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 stop. <laughs> God. All right, got one back, finally, <laughs> got one back. Beautiful. Now a par five, that'd be sweet. And team off on this par four. That last drive was a freaking bullet. I don't think it had much height at all on it. <clears throat> that one did though. Little bit of spin on it, but man, I crushed that. 164 ball speed, which is pretty damn good for me. It was all uphill. So that was a 280 carry right there with 3,100 backspin. If I can get that backspin down a little bit, that would be like 290 man, carry potentially. 20 yards out. What is it? 120? Where is this located at actually? Oh, it's doable. <sighs> Might be a little bullet of a shot, but stay right there now. All right, that works. And I think he will be pleased with that. I was like just really low on the face. Weird, weird this swing. For the birdie. All right, it's going right at first. It's going to kick back left at the end. I think I need to go a little bit more left here. 61 feet. Whew. Okay. that's gonna be pretty decent oh yeah oh that was close that was close <clears throat> you gotta be another par five kind of up here somewhere i swear top score is 16 under <clears throat> <clears throat> did you say 16 under on the 16th tee. jesus what do we got here? 169, seven feet up hill. Oh, I think it's going to get there. It's just not going to be what I wanted it to be. <coughs> All right, stay right there. Oh, come on. All right, that's doable. Again, that approach is on the green, but... Uh, yeah, it was only 161. Putt ahead. I got that low on the face. Five feet to the cup. That thing is going left to right a ton here. So we're gonna move it way over here. It's probably too much, but I'd rather have it that than not. It's at 52 feet. Get up there, go, get up there, get up there. Oh, I had the line too.
Okay, be another par five, please. Please. Currently Reachable out, par five. Two for the day. And let's see what the 17th nope. has in store. But a fun hole nonetheless. All right. <laughs> Let's smash this one. I want this to be a 310 yard carry with the, with the elevation change, obviously. So let's see what we can do here. Oh, that one's too high on the face. Dang it. That sucked. Give me a good kick right. <clears throat> All right, that's good enough. That was very poor. I don't think you'll be too pleased with that Hi, shot. Hi, kids. That, the learn from that is don't try to hammer the living piss out of a shot just to get it and carrying at 310 yards. Deep in the rough, folks. It's not going to work out in your favor. <clears throat> Sandwich. I don't think so. I hit it far, but not that far. Hit it low on the face again. Come on, be enough to get up there at least on the green. Just want it on the green. <sighs> and uh, Damn it. I think he's gonna like that. Is it on the green? That thing stopped like a dime. It's in the fringe. Ugh, potting at least. <sighs> 47. Why am I going over here? <laughs> All right, I'm gonna move this a little bit more. 47 feet, a little left to right. Quite a bit left to right, actually. I need to slow down. Fudge, fudgy the whale. That's one of my problems today is lag putts like just way too damn far. And about 16 feet left to go. Nope. Too, uh, too far to the right. Dang. Ah. Uh. I just, these stupid little mistakes like that. Like I make it on the green and then I just lag putt it. So craptastical. And as we check the scores, our what are we on? currently sitting at 17. 17. 17. Teeing it up here on the 18th. All right, at least this final one is a par five. That'd be sweet the eagle is, but still wouldn't get me back to, down to where I want to be. Serious power involved. Had in some a, spin to it. A drive like this. Straight though. <clears throat> that one was very straight. All right, this is only going to be like a freaking pitching wedge or nine iron into this par five, which is kind of crazy. And about 170 yards to the pin. What? 170 yards? I carried that son of a bitch. Freaking. 300 practically that's odd all right we're gonna hit an eight iron into this hoping that's enough because of the downhill 20 some feet I'm gonna try to pound it too i know i said you're not supposed to do that but we're gonna do it anyways <clears throat> and i pounded it an that's gotta get there Oh, we got ourselves an eagle opportunity, guys. And that is some fantastic <laughs> club work. Oh, the beaut. Five green, hitting it in two. And this next putt for a final round score of 73. All right, we always like an eagle.
Oh, I hit it too Ooh, hard. Just missing here. I hit it too hard. Dang. It's all right, birdie on the last hole is better than a freaking bogey or even a par, so I'm happy with that. Yeah, I, I hammered that a <laughs> but <laughs> it's been my problem yesterday and today, actually. Uh, hitting, par, hitting putts too hard, so not bad. Two over, a bogey would have got, or a eagle would have gotten me to one over, which would have been sweet. Let's check out the scorecards, see how we did. So, come on now. There we go. Uh, about even keel on both sides. A couple, a couple, uh, three bogeys on the front. Just stupid bogeys though, you know? It's like, and uh, actually I was even, even on the back. Not bad. Yeah, not too bad, I'll take it. I mean, my swing felt way better today than I did yesterday and today, this morning. So I got that going for me. Hopefully things will come together. It's our club championship Saturday, Sunday. So I'm hoping to play well to get into maybe the top 10 there. So um, thanks for coming along again today. Happy Sunday to you. Uh, until next time, peace y'all.